Hi there, welcome back. We've got episode number 13. I just did 12. That was really great. And yeah, it ended with, um, yeah, Buffy turning the tables on the council. And now she has the council in her pocket, it seems like, where they were going to try and kind of bully her and Giles into doing what they wanted. It didn't work out for them. And she figured them out and she realized she was the one with the power. And now she has them kind of working for her, I guess. Yeah, so we're going to find out what they know. That's what we're going to find out, I think, in this episode, hopefully. Unless it's another self-contained thing, and that happens sometimes, or a lot, a lot of time in this show, and they go back to it later, so maybe that's the case. But I'm hoping that we'll find out more about how to defeat Glory, that, or Glorificus. Is it Glorificus or Glorifica? Well, either way, Glory. Yeah, hopefully they'll get to find out how to defeat her, because she's a god, right? How to defeat a god. How do you defeat a god? I don't know. But maybe they can summon another god to do it, a good god. I don't know. I thought all gods were good. I guess not. No, I don't think that's right, actually. In Greek, Greek mythology, I don't think that's right. I think there are some malevolent gods as well, right? I think so. Yeah, anyway, looking forward to it. Let's get to it. This is exactly what you need. A 20th birthday party with, with the oh. presents and funny hats. I just don't think this is the best time to break out the party pinata. We need to stay focused if we're going to find a way to stop glory. An actual mightier-than-thou god. Well, you know what they say, the bigger they are, the faster they stomp you into nothing. <laughs> Bit of reality from Anya. She's right. Yeah. Glory and two of her fellow hell gods ruled over oh. one of the more seriously unpleasant demon dimensions. There's more than one? Oh, there are thousands of demon dimensions. All different. Oh. All pushing on the edges of our reality, trying to find a way in. Oh, great. The question is why? Well, there's nothing to indicate that here. Is the portal to let all the other demons in from that? world yes sir a uh, dominion but no bolts of lightning no blasts of fire shouldn't a god be able to do that kind of stuff well usually you probably yes. can but um being in human form must be severely limiting her powers oh so that's why she needs to feed on human brains i guess From what i've been able to gather her living in this world is seriously affecting her mental state as well she's only being able to keep her mind intact by okay. uh, Extracting energy from us absorbs the energies that bind the human mind into a cohesive whole. Once drained, all that's left behind is uh, crazy. Council got it spot on. I'm afraid while well, there's been a marked increase in the ranks of the mentally unstable here in Sunnydale. At least vampires just kill you. Yeah, they're almost humane vampires compared to Glory. I know way more about demon dimensions than Giles does. <laughs> oh, I do. <laughs> she does, Giles. Give her that it's key thingy Glory's looking for. Yeah, I mean, shouldn't we be trying to find it before she does? I think it's time, isn't it? Mind you, it's dangerous. They have that information. Do we know what used to be kept? Who saw it last? How are they going to put them off this? Me. We, we know where it is. Oh. You what? If Glory knew that you guys knew where it was, I, I just didn't want to put you in that kind dangerous. of danger. Yeah. As opposed to the other kind we're always in? <laughs> That's a good point, but Glory is a different kind of danger. You're right. If I were Buffy here, I'd just say, well, there's a very good reason and you'll you'll know eventually and just trust me. It's time. Oh, she's going to tell them. They're going to be risking their lives. They deserve to know. Know what? I don't know if this is a good idea, honestly. There's something that you need to know about Dawn. The link must be severed. Hey. Such is the will of God. Oh, it's the order. The link must be severed. Such, Such is the will of God. The key, key is, is the, the link. link. Oh, they're trying to stop it. They want to destroy the key, do they? I fear your faith is gravely misplaced. No. <laughs> it's gonna be groveling now. Oh, oh, who stopped it? Oh, oh, glory. Never send a minion to do a god's work. <laughs> yeah, you're for it now, boys. I mean, they know who she is, right? You can't fight a god. What are they doing? They should just run. Mate, it's not gonna happen. Nice Keep it up. Bet it hurts. Yeah. They're a bit dumb. Okay, I'm a little bit confused then. So they said they want to sever. Did they say sever the link? The keys to link or something? And they want to sever it? It seems like maybe they were. Yeah, they want to yeah, put an end to Dawn basically and make the key unavailable, I guess. Okay. Is some sort of protection spell or detection spell, maybe? You guys doing a spell? Don, hey, yeah, we're doing an early warning incantation. Detection. Screechy siren things will, you know, screech. 
<laughs> this should give us a heads up so we can hide the um, key. <laughs> we already put one up around your house. Interesting that Dawn hasn't asked where it is. I really like Willow's hair, by the way. That's she great. She's just kind of new. Mm. How's my sweet fancy Dawn doing? <laughs> Fine. What's up with you? Oh, is he trying to feel sorry for her, right? You make a very pretty little girl. Oh my god, Anya. <laughs> Shut Anya, you the fuck up. With that thing? <laughs> <laughs> Xander needs help with his thing. <laughs> god. This is why Buffy should have told, well, should have told Anya at least. How was school today? Um, the usual. Big square building filled with boredom and despair. <laughs> Just how I remember it. <laughs> Me too. What's the homework sitch? We have to imagine what we'll be like 10 years from now and write a letter to our future self. I've just remembered something. Like you tell me anyway. Dawn's too young and Dawn's too delicate. A young delicate pain in my butt. Mm. I just think you're freaking out because you have to fight someone prettier than you. That is the case, right? <laughs> Jesus, Dawn. Glory I wouldn't is say evil so. and powerful and in no way prettier than me. I just <laughs> think you're getting soft in your advanced age. She didn't look that tough to me. Okay. One more time. Didn't see her in action, just Dawn. Oh, shit. Me and you. oh, she's taking him hostage. Our itsy bitsy Torturing him. little secret. Where is the key? Well, Even if I knew, I'd die know. a thousand deaths before I tell you. You won't need a thousand, sweetie. <laughs> I'll make the first one last. <laughs> that was a good line. What is it with you religious types? I know how difficult the first time can be. Broken him now. You don't have to be afraid. You still got something I need. Oh, gonna suck his brain. Yeah, so the thing I just remembered was Dawn. When we first saw Dawn, the first episode, episode two, was it this season? She said Buffy's in for a surprise if she thinks that I'm just normal or something like that. So what was that about? I'd forgotten about that. Or was that just for our benefit because she's the key and it wasn't really coming from her, maybe? Thank you, guys. Oh, we See thought I mean? you get lots of crossbows and other killy stuff. Yes, yeah, so killy stuff. Less killy, more frilly. <laughs> Let's kill him more freely. It's just that was so good. lovely. Oh, I wish it was mine. No. Do you want it, Anya? Is that what Bobby's going to say? Like you oh, no. were all thinking the same thing. <laughs> said no, I wasn't. I've got one just like it. Here. Open mine. I bet. It's not going to explode, is it? It's when we visited Dad oh. this summer in San Diego. Um, I put the shells on it mm, myself. It wasn't real, was it? We picked them off the beach. I remember. Oh my god. Oh, oh Anya. Jeez, don't get all movie of the week. Thank you. What are you doing in there? Party getting slow? Oh. Oh, she's listening in again. It's cake time. Why does everybody start acting all weird when I'm around? Me? Me not weird? No, no, we really weren't. It's inevitable at this point. We were talking about sex. <laughs> they were talking about me Good just like actually. everybody is. You know us, sometimes we like to pretend stuff. Um, Anya. You know, like say there's a fireman or a shepherd. <laughs> you know what? Let's not have this exchange of images right now. Fine. I'm just going to go to bed. That way I won't accidentally get exposed to, like, words. Mm. Oh no, Dawn, what are you doing? Oh, she's listening through the out from outside. Oh my god. Yeah, it's never spoiled at this point. She's gonna find out, or they're just gonna have to tell her. Oh, where's she? She's leaving. Dawn, no. Dory's gonna get you. Spike, okay. Jeez, lurk much? I wasn't lurking. <laughs> no, he's I was standing about. It's a whole different vibe. <laughs> he's stalking again. Are you giving Buffy a birthday present? Oh my god. Weird and chocolates oh they're the chocolates he was practicing with she'd never touch anything from you anyway <laughs> shouldn't you be tucked away in your bed by <laughs> all warm and safe where nothing can eat you is that supposed to scare me <sighs> little tremble wouldn't hurt sorry it's just <laughs> so pathetic spike come on i'm better than you <laughs> i'm not m2 you're standing in the bushes hugging now with a your bench two. box of chocolates and i'm what Sneaking yeah, out where there and here and watch Teletubbies with your mates? No. <laughs> I'm breaking into the magic shop. No? To steal things. Magic shop, eh? Steal what? Did you some magic? A number of beasties between here and there. <laughs> but they'd really go now for he's the gonna escort her. like you. 
That wouldn't set too well with the big sister. Spike want to go. I can take care of myself. You want to come steal some stuff? <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> what does Spike want from this place? Money probably is we're gonna raid the cash register. That's right. Feels bad now. <laughs> hey, pick locks. He badass. What's the caper? Jewels, ancient artifacts, or just plain hard cash liberated from the till. <laughs> That's what Spike wants. All this for a book? I don't want the book. Just what's inside. I think it was hmm? Giles's notes. Oh. He was standing here. And when I turned around, it was gone. And wait till Buffy finds out that Spike helped her. <laughs> Where did he learn to write so bloody Convenient. small? Fruit fly? <laughs> wait, here's something. Bro, hammer. Oh. This, the hammer's still knocking about. Didn't go with my stuff anyway. <laughs> the key is not directly described in any known literature, but all research indicates an energy matrix vibrating at a dimensional frequency beyond normal human perception. Only those outside reality can see the key's true nature. Outside reality. What's that mean? Mm. Second sight blokes, mostly. Is that a, like a trance? Just your run of the mill lunatics. Like the Buffy did. There! No one oh, there. of course. I know you are. To say about this oh, shit. Key. You figured yeah, this out. Old. Maybe we can hawk it. Yeah, they were Spike definitely outside Spike. reality. And they were um, definitely lunatics. The key is also susceptible to necromanced animal detection, particularly those of canine or serpent construct. The beast. That she created. Oh my god. Quite clueless. <laughs> Monks possess the ability to transform energy, bend reality. Oh, darn. Blah, blah, blah. Good lord, Giles writes as dull as he talks, doesn't he? <laughs> I started work, but the council has suggested to us that they were interrupted. So they sent the key to her in human form. Ah, oh, what a way to find in the out. Form of a sister. Oh no, explicitly said now. I mean, she knew it anyway, right? Oh huh. shit, even Spike knows now. I guess that's you, Nibbler. <laughs> oh. Okay. I said it was inevitable. I didn't know it would be in the next five minutes, so. Not even a card, huh? I wasn't really expecting one. You think Angel would send us something? Oh, oh my god. Oh, sh oh shit! Oh, Isn't Dawn. Dawn! Oh, baby. Dawn, you are real, though. What You're a real you human. This is blood, isn't it? It can't be me. I'm not a key. I'm not a thing. Oh, sweetie, no. What, what is this all about? What am I? Oh, that was a good actor. Am I real? Am I anything? <laughs> if you need anything. Thanks. At least she'll be able to protect herself and be a bit more cautious now. Or try to protect herself, should I say. Being cautious, that's a good thing. I just... We thought it would be better if we waited until you were older. How old am I now? You're 14, sweetheart. You know that. No. What's the, the key? Monks. When did... When did they... When did they create it? Six months ago. I've only been alive for six months, huh? You've been alive a lot longer than that to us. You don't know that. You don't know anything. I know I care about you. I know that I worry about you. You worry about me because you have to. I'm your job. Protect the key, right? I worry because my sister is cutting herself. Yeah? How do you know? Maybe it's just another fake memory from my fake family. Sweetheart. Get out. Don. Get out. Get out. Get out! This is to be expected. It's not just going to instantly accept this. I may never accept it. How did she get in here? In the... Ew! Oh. Who's been using the urn of Ishtar as an ashtray? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh Spike. Morning, sunshine. Good luck. Eggs and sausage and fresh out. <laughs> hey, careful. 
I was just along for the ride. Yeah, I didn't know. Not like I knew she was mystical, glowy, key thing. Nobody keeps me in the bloody loop, do they? The reason for that, Spike. Something goes wrong in your life. Blame Spike. News flash, Blondie. Yeah. Talking, Blondie. She'll find a way sooner or later. I just thought she'd be safer with Big Bad looking over her shoulder. Big Bad. Still thinks he's Big Bad. She shouldn't have found out like that. You didn't think you could keep the truth from her forever, did you? Maybe if you had been more honest with her in the first place, you wouldn't be trying to make yourself feel better with a round of kick to Spike. He just refer to himself in the third person. <laughs> I'm not anything. Honey, calm down, okay? Don't tell me what to do. You're not my mother. I mean, actual teenagers who are actually the daughter say stuff like that. I would rather be at school. I can't even imagine what Dawn would be thinking and what, what do you do? Where do you go from there? <laughs> Byzantium. Yes. Oh, They've arrived. Unfortunate, but not completely unexpected. Old animosities aside, your fate is directly linked to her magnificently scented Florificus. She's been extremely forgiving of your considerable foibles up until now, but if you persist in your defiance, she'll be forced to... To what? What is she going to do? Send a six-pack of minions to bore me to death? Glory can't lay a finger on me. You know it, I know it, she knows oh. it. So save the threats, or I'll finish the job I started on your head. Here, God too, or something. Or is she gonna burn it or something? Rip it up. None of it's real. Her school called today. She was suspended. Oh. She yelled at a teacher. She's not real. We're not her family. We don't even know what she is. Oh my God. Oh shit. I guess this is like adoption, right? If so, if the adopted kid finds out, if they were never told. Is that what they're trying to do with this storyline? Maybe. I'm gonna set it alight, don't do it in the house. The Slayer is the only thing standing between Dawn and this god from the bitch dimension that wants to shove her in some kind of lock and give her a good twirl. <laughs> the bitch dimension. <laughs> Oh my God, yeah, she set it alight. No, Smoke alarm. It's not glory. No, she could have burned the house down. Buffy. No, not hung She's herself, was she? No. Fuck, for a second I thought they went there. Money, that wasn't... <laughs> glory wouldn't just go Buffy. <laughs> oh my God. The Donmeister Chronicles? Oh, she's been keeping those since... I mean... Since she was seven. Six months ago. I remember too well. We have to find her. It's weird, isn't it? Fast. Before Glory or the Knights of Hack and Slash figure out what, who she really is. Spike, you and I'll get the east side. Just find her, please. Yeah, even though Glory doesn't know she's the key, if Glory bumps into her, if she's her, that's a way to get Buffy to tell her, right? Mind you, if Buffy tells her, she'll die anyway. <laughs> but if she doesn't tell her, Glory will kill her. Can she be killed? She's a key. She was bleeding, right? God, that's... That's heartbreaking. There's so many things I remember. Seeing Don, hanging with her, listening to Buffy complain about her. Mostly that last one. They could drop these monks, didn't they? You know, uh, she kind of has a crush on me. <laughs> point thing. Oh, nothing. No. What's your point? Just saying. Powerful. She's so important. <laughs> big energy Thunder. gal digging the Zan man. <laughs> Some guys are just cooler, you know? <laughs> Keep telling yourself that, Sander. <laughs> Don? Of course. The niblet scampered off to get away from you. What's he calling her a niblet? Can't say I blame her. You were right. Hmm? This is kind of was. Fault. I think they... I should have told her. Even though I was saying they shouldn't. Yeah. Now she's found out the way she has, in hindsight. She probably would have skipped off anyway. Even if she never found out. She's not just a blob of energy, she's also a 14-year-old hormone bomb. <laughs> You'll find her just in the nick of time. That's what you hero types do. <laughs> you hero types. You'll find her. And then what? 
Oh, it really feels like he cares sometimes, and other times I just think, surely it's just lust, I can't figure it out. Better find her before Glory does. Oh, another crazy person she's fed on. Oh, this doctor gonna... Doesn't know she's the key, but... Tries to comfort her or something, she might confide in him. Which might be a good thing, I don't know, I can't figure out... This doctor's good or bad? I think he's good. We can't stop. It's here. Oh, is she going to try and get some info from them? It's here. It's here. Make it stop. It's here. The skin's too tight. Who made me? What What am I? Please. Destroy her. Cracked her in the boats. The sun bleeding into the sky. No. The keys are leaking. No. <laughs> Did he say destroy her? Or destroy her? <laughs> Two steaming yeah. cups of chocolate goodness, courtesy of whoever I swiped it from out of the cupboard. I think we're going to find out if this guy's good or bad pretty soon. My mom's just fine. Mm. Is there anybody I can call? My mom. Your sister? I don't have a sister. Oh. You do have a fight? This might be it's okay. Thing I know how that goes. If he finds out. I got a sister too. It can be a real pain sometimes, huh? I tell you, there have been a lot of nights I wish she didn't exist either. It's not Buffy. Wait. It's me. Glory, his sister. I'm the one that doesn't exist. It's not real. None of this. They made it. Don. I'm nothing. I'm just a thing the monks made so Glory couldn't find me. I'm not real. No. <laughs> You're the key. How do you know about the key? Go. Before she finds you, don't ask me how she yeah, knows because okay. she always knows. Just go. Wait, come down. Don't good. understand. You're a kid. You stay, she'll find you. She finds you, she'll hurt you. What's wrong with you? You're what she's been searching for. I am telling you, run. You don't know. You. Oh, no. oh God, no. She's coming. I can oh, feel shit. it. You've got to get, get out of there. No. Go on. Don't just stop. Oh, no. She's here. Oh. She's here. Oh. Oh shit! Hey, don't I know you? Wait, is he Dawn or something? Or could a fabric be more annoyingly pedestrian? She just now this is what I'm talking Fake about. Fake being him somehow morph into uh, makes your skin sick. <laughs> you're you're Ben. Uh, it's an insy more complicated than that. Family always is, isn't it? Right. You'd never make it. I'd rip out your spine before you got half a stat. What in the world was the Slayer's little sis doing here with John O'Ben? You don't remember. Remember what? You were talking to him. Oh, not okay. Me. Oh, well, he wasn't being naughty, was he? So she didn't hear any of that. So she doesn't know she's the key. So how does she just jump from him? <laughs> you and I can have a long, uninterrupted chat. Right. I'm confused. How does she not hear any of that? Anything could have happened to her. Not just Glory. We better check the hospital. No, just Glory, as it turned out. Small talk over. She doesn't know she's the key, right? Crunch here, so let's cut right to the Uwe Gooey Center. The Slayer has my key. It's mine, I want yeah. it. What does it look like? Green, swirly shimmer. Really brought out the blue in my eyes. <laughs> yes. Maybe if you told me more about it. Mm, that's clever. I'd know if I've seen it. A way to get some info. I'm not sure you're going to live long enough to... What happens if she kills Dawn? Does she reveal the key or something? Okay. I mean, she doesn't know she's the key, but... Okay. Okay. So she's going to use Dawn as bait to get the key, and Dawn's the key. Just to clean off. Oh. Glory. Is it Why evil? would she just tell her totally. all about it? <laughs> well, no, not really. No, evil I to her. It depends on your point of view. Yeah. Okay. What's it for? If it's a key, there's got to be a lock, right? Yes. Portal. We D have a winner. Her, the world that she rules so over is it. Open? The demon world. Let all the demons in, I guess, to this world. I smell a fox in my hen house. Oh. So what you've been playing sugar and spice with Uncle Ben? I kind of want to hear me talking right now. She just called me Uncle talking. Ben. 
Is that for Dawn's benefit? Maybe you don't have any idea where my key is. <laughs> Very irritating, <laughs> irrational, like bugs under my skin. And say, I'm feeling a little. Oh, she needs to feed. What's wrong with you? Dawn, hey. let's hope it's not on Dawn. I've been meaning to send this layer a message. But I could use a little pick me up. Two birds, oh my god. One stone. I mean, Buffy's gonna. Well, Boom. she can't stop her. You have yummy dead birds. Get away from my sister. I mean, what are you gonna do? We were just talking about you. Conversation's over, hell bitch. Hell bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Spike. Now's the test, the real test. Are you willing to take on a god? Oh, he is. Of course he is. <laughs> He's, hold <laughs> He's holding her for it. Oh, I thought he'd been knocked out for some oh, shit. He might be now. <laughs> Sander! I mean, you've got no chance, Sander. But we know what he's like. If he wakes up, tell your boyfriend oh, to watch He's got the crossbow. Is that Giles? <laughs> he is not my boyfriend. <laughs> boyfriend. Oh, they're doing a spell. What's this going to do? They work on a god, whatever it is. Giles, now! How have they planned this? Oh, oh. please. Like, that's going to. Oh. Hey! <laughs> Sander! Watch the hair. Uh. Oh! Get back! Oh, nice fuck! Catch. Is that the best you little crap nats could muster? Because I gotta tell you, so not. Impressed. Where this belt does, it better work. Look what you did to my dress, you little. Bitter. Just Katie. Oh! Okay, it, was, it did work on a god. Alright, that's some powerful magic. Oh. What happened to her? What Send her somewhere else. Teleportation spell. Yeah. Still working out the kinks. Where'd you send her? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. No. It's one of the kinks. <laughs> no. Oh my god. Where's she gonna end up? Oh. Oh shit. In the Oh what the fuck? Okay. Was that a boss sunny doll? Dangerous spell for an adept at your level. Yeah. <laughs> Won't be trying that one again soon. <laughs> It's just like mine. Doesn't matter where you came from or, or or how you got here. You are my sister. There's no way you could annoy me so much if you weren't. <laughs> no. Ben, he was here. He was trying to help me. He... Yeah, what's with that? I I think he might have left before Glory came. I can't I can't remember. Oh. It's okay. Glory kind of popped out from him. Mom's freaking out. Is she mad about the whole fire thing? <laughs> I think you sort of have a get out of jail free card on account of big love and drama. Really? Okay. Good. Mm. Well, that kind of shows she's feeling like I think she'd raise my a daughter, house. right? Don't push it. I miss what she said there. Let me just see that. Hear that again. Sorry, I just talked over that last part. Hold on. Did she say? Do you think she'd, she'll raise my allowance or something? Like pocket money? Is that what she said? Yeah, I think she's looking for extra money, right? Yeah, that was really good again. Another good one. Another really good one. I'm really confused about... Um, was it Ben? Have I got that right? Have I finally got that name? Yeah, the doctor. In case it isn't Ben. I'm confused about what's going on there. So that's another thing I need to look at again, actually. Because I think, he's, I think she said... I think they're siblings, but then she said something about an uncle. Oh my god. I either talked over it or just missed it. I don't know. Hold on. I need to find the episode now. I've just closed it out. Let me just quickly... Sorry. <laughs> Let me just quickly see if I can figure this out. Well, hear it, actually. Hold on. Yeah, so Ben or the Doctor said, yeah, I've got a sister too, to Dawn. I think Dawn said she's not my sister and he said, yeah, I've got a sister too and I know what it's like. She's a pain in the ass." So that must be Glory, right? I'm thinking, okay. But why she sort of popped out from him, that's what happened, right? I think. Do I have to watch that again? I don't think so. I think that's what happened. She just suddenly appeared. Ben disappeared and she appeared like instantaneously in the same spot. So they're, I guess they're linked somehow. Are they, are they like both gods or something? And they share, they've both, because they've come to this world uh, from wherever they're from, I guess maybe therefore they share, they share each other's body somehow or something i don't know i might be completely wrong I'm, i hope it wasn't sort of 
revealed during these scenes that why that happened. I don't think so. Um, yeah, but then she says about, um, did she say uncle, is it Ben? I'm just going to call him Ben because I think that's his name. If not, forgive me. I'll get it. <laughs> um, she said uncle Ben to, um, Glory, uh, to Dawn, right? When she was with uh, Dawn, when Glory was with Dawn, she said, she said uncle Ben. So I think she said that to kind of, because she was talking to Dawn. So as if like, oh, he's uncle Ben to you. You're having a little chat with Uncle Ben, where you kind of thing, you know. I think that's what that was. So I think actually she's probably his sister, his siblings, which is surprising. Okay, but he's a good. I mean, maybe he, maybe they're both hell. That doesn't seem like it. If he's a hell god himself as well, or maybe he's not. Maybe he's just the the brother. Maybe if he is the brother to Dawn, who is the hell god. Maybe I don't know. But maybe he's also one. Maybe I'm not sure. We haven't seen any powers from him yet. I don't think so. Maybe I don't know. But yeah, just because they're from the same place, it doesn't necessarily mean they want the same thing. So she wants, I'm guessing she wants to let in all the demons from her world, which must be hell, one of the hells or something, through this portal. And he doesn't want her to do that, I'm thinking, even though maybe he's her brother. Okay. So what was that conversation? I need to watch that again, that conversation with Dreg when Dreg visited him when he was getting into his car. He said something like, oh, um, was it something about cleaning up a mess? And what's that about? I don't know. I'll probably need to watch that again. <laughs> oh, my memory <laughs> it sucks. Um, but another good one, another really good one. I did feel a bit like, okay, well, the magic's got him out of a tough spot again. You know, I've mentioned this before. It's fine. There is a tiny bit of me that thinks, well, it's an easy way out. You know, I mean, that was the only way out there because she's a god. I mean, Buffy wasn't going to. You know, they obviously planned what they what they did there, obviously. So, yeah, so that was a distraction, I get. Unless it wasn't, because that was that was probably a real crossbow and it just bounced off her because... But it was still a, a distraction, I think, when when Giles shot her. <laughs> um, just so it would momentarily just, well, distract her and, yeah, they did the spell. So it gave them a chance to throw the glitter over her, I guess. But, yeah, so I don't think they expected that. Because, I, yeah, I was thinking, what well, when I saw it bounce off her, I thought, oh, it must have been like a a toy one and it was just a distraction but actually she's a god so it probably was a real one even they probably even expected it would bounce off her and yeah she just she was just able to take it no problem because she's a god right probably so it probably was a real yeah crossbow okay so yeah that was like it was all planned and yeah it worked <laughs> so that was kind of weird that she ended up above i guess the town i guess that was sunnydale and then she just kind of descended quickly and we didn't really get to see that did we what happened i'm sure she survived yeah, but as she was descending, she was kind of leaving behind some sort of trail, like red, almost rainbow-like trail. I don't know what that was about, but okay. But she didn't seem like too happy that, you know, she was in that situation. She was like, oh shit, kind of thing. So maybe she hurt herself. I don't know. I don't know, but they didn't show that, did they? But that was kind of random, and I don't know really where that was. I guess it was Sunnydale, so she's probably still in Sunnydale. Um, yeah, it was interesting that they don't know where they sent her, and yet they were hanging around talking about it. It was like, well... She could have been the next room for, for all they knew. They could have sent her there. I don't know, but yeah. Okay. Luckily that didn't happen, but yeah. You think they'd have got out of there quickly though. But I mean, they, uh, Buffy sent Dawn and um, Joyce. I keep forgetting names. Jo Dawn and Joyce to spike for protection, right? And to hide out kind of thing. But that's kind of out the window now, I guess. Now that, oh well, no, she doesn't know. I was going to say now that, um, uh, Glory knows Dawn's the key, but she doesn't, does she? So, okay. So really, Buffy should get everyone out now, shouldn't she, really? I mean, Buffy should... That, everyone should just leave Sunnydale, really. That's... I mean, she, they, she'd find them, I, I imagine, but... I don't know. I, I don't know. Would she? I don't know. Being a god, you think she would, but... Wait, she didn't know... Buffy, she didn't know about Buffy, did she? She didn't even know that she was a slayer even, so maybe she just wouldn't find them and she couldn't find the key, could she? She needed that serpent thing, the beast that she created to do it for her. I don't know why she hasn't tried that again, honestly, but okay. Um, okay, so yeah, so the conversation, I'm going to call him Ben again. I think it's Ben. I hope it's so now. Um, yeah, the conversation that Dawn had with Ben, yeah, Glory didn't hear any of that somehow. Okay, so even if they do sort of share the same body in a way, I don't really know how that works. We've never seen them together, have we? So that's possible. Maybe that's why. 
how would that work even? So when we see Ben, when we see the Doctor, I'm going to call him Ben, like I said. Sorry, forgive me if I'm wrong. But when we see Ben, does that mean Glory doesn't exist at that moment? I don't know. Seem likely. And vice versa? I don't know. I don't know how that worked because when we see Glory, surely Ben's at the hospital working, he just suddenly disappears. Now that doesn't even work, does it? I mean, what happened there then? So what happened there? I'm confused. What happened? Why did he suddenly disappear and she appeared? Oh, fuck. I'll watch it. I'll watch it again. I wasn't going to because honestly, I'll be here all night, but I'm going to watch that again. Just that scene where that happened. Just to see if he said anything before that that I missed. Or, I don't know. But give me a second. Okay. Okay. <laughs> So he said, oh, no, she's coming. She's coming. you got to run. And then he said, uh, 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 I can feel her. So he could feel her entering his body, maybe, or something. Okay, so how did... Okay, so there must be a very close connection, obviously. But there must be a really close connection between Ben and Glory for her to... Because why else would she appear... In, right there, right then, where Dawn is. So Glory must have felt something was happening at that point through Ben, through the Doctor, right? Still confused. Because she even finished his sentence there because he said, she's here. And then he she finished the here part, the here word. She's here and she said here. And, and then she's like, oh, don't I know you? Like, like she was almost summoned there. <laughs> And yet she didn't know that Dawn was the key. She didn't hear any of that conversation. She didn't really know why she was there. So why isn't she suspicious then? If that's the case, why doesn't Glory think, oh, hold on. I was just attracted here for some reason. And here's Dawn in my hat, in my arms. I've got Dawn in my arms. So if she was brought there, summoned there, surely she, unless her memory completely wiped and she doesn't, but if that, not com she still knows she's after the key, so it's not completely wiped. I don't get that. So surely she'd think, hang on, why can't I remember what's going on here? And I know you, don't I? And why am I here? Surely, being a god, she'd realise that I'm here for a reason and look who's in front of me. Why is Dawn in front of me? I guess she could think, even though she didn't quite recognise her at first as being Buffy's sister, I don't think, but why wouldn't she... Maybe that's why, maybe she's, maybe she thinks when, when she realised it was Buffy's sister, maybe she thought, that's why I was brought here. I don't know. How does that work? I don't know. I don't know. I, I'm thinking she'd figure out that Dawn was the key, wouldn't she? That's why she was summoned there suddenly, but I don't know. It's really confusing, really weird. Hmm. Okay. I'm also wondering, being a god... Why does she need to feed, like, being a god, you're all powerful, right? It's not her world, is it, apparently? I don't think. So, so being a hell god, or a hell bitch, as Buffy called her, that was funny. Yeah, being that powerful, you'd think, or well, you wouldn't think she'd need to do anything. She'd think she'd survive anyway, you know, but obviously, that's not the case, obviously, but that's kind of weird. But that is the case, so, okay. Okay, I mean, I'm so confused, I don't know. I mean, I think they're siblings now. I think they are. I don't know. I mean, there are if it's siblings, you can have an evil one and a good one, can't you? And but surely, if he's her brother, he's from the same place, and she's from some sort of hell. She's a hell god, some other world, some other hell, or something. So how can he be good? I mean, there are good demons, as we know that. So I don't. I, We'll find out, won't we? We'll find out. I'm confused as fuck, but I think I was supposed to be. I hope so. There's probably stuff I miss. I always miss stuff because I talk over stuff. People know that by now. We watch these reactions and yeah, sometimes I go back like I did here and yeah, see what I missed in certain parts. And turns out I don't think I missed anything actually. Um, But that's why I was thinking I did because I'm confused, but hopefully we're supposed to be. And hopefully, well, I'm sure it will be <laughs> revealed eventually. I'll catch up eventually if I'm if I should know already. Don't worry, I'll catch up eventually hopefully um yeah but good episode another good one another good one i think i preferred the other one but this one was really good as well i'm gonna score it i think i'm gonna give it um an 8.5 it, it was really good with dawn's um, reaction to finding out you know that was a typical reaction as well it was it was very realistic and she was really good she 
she was acting really well. I like her, actually. I really like her. She's a good actor. I wonder how old she actually was. I think someone told me, actually, she was like 15 or something. She's about the same age, I think. So, okay. And they filmed it, you know. Yeah, she's really good. For someone that age, she's really good. Really good. And she convinced me she looked really kind of um, devastated and angry and confused. Just how you'd imagine. Yeah, she did a really good job. Mm, they've cast a good one there. Yeah. I hope she lasts because I like her as well. I just like her, the character, you know. I like her. Not just the actor. I like the character. I really hope she lasts, but I can't see it somehow. But maybe now she's found out and she's kind of accepted it, kind of, that, you know, that was sweet as well with Buffy and, um, yeah, Joyce as well, obviously, and, yeah, everyone really. But with Buffy and her and the talk they had and he's convinced her that, that, that you to me you are my sister. It reminded me, actually, of um that Dumbledore line. <laughs> I'm never going to remember this. It was something like, just because it's in your head, it doesn't mean it isn't real, right? If you've seen um, Harry Potter, you probably know which scene I'm talking about in King's Cross. That's all I'm going to say. I'm not going to spoil it for those who haven't seen it or who possibly want to in the future. But yeah, that line. I mean, that line's kind of a spoilery, spoilery kind of line, but not really. No one's going to figure out why that was said, but yeah. Yeah, so it reminded me of that. Yeah, kind of. So, yeah, just because it's in their heads and yeah, it doesn't mean it's not real. I mean, if you think it's real and you've got all the memories, then it is real to you, isn't it? So, yeah, I was going to say that during reaction, but there wasn't time. Um, yeah, action pack one again. I really like these action pack ones that, you know, there's a lot of progression and a lot of things happening. And they're enjoyable. They're kind of difficult to react to sometimes when there's so much information and new people, new characters, new information. It's difficult because just reactions in general, you're talking over it, like I said, and yeah, you've got the added stuff of lights in my eyes, although it's easier now because I figured out what to do and with the with the player itself, I've turned up the brightness, but the picture's quality is really poor, but it doesn't matter because I do that now. It's better than missing everything, I guess, but I'm someone who really likes a good picture. I really want a good picture and it's not when I do that, but it's okay. I can see better in the, well, I, I see everything now in the dark. Actually, at the start of this, I forgot to do it <laughs> and I was like, what? I can't see. Why? I realised I didn't uh, adjust it. Okay. Anyway, yep. Um, yeah, I enjoyed it. Another good one. And I did score it, didn't I? Yeah, 8.5. Yeah, good. And uh, really looking forward to seeing how this develops now. And how many have we got left? That was 13, right? Okay, so there's only nine episodes left. Okay. That's well, still quite a lot, isn't it? Okay. People have told me this is a really, really good season and it is, it's panning out to be now. It's really heating up, isn't it? Yeah, I'm really looking forward to the next, yeah, nine episodes. And then we'll only have two seasons after that. But yeah, still a long way to go. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you for episode number 14. See you then. See ya. Bye.